Hello, hello everyone. Happy Creepy 13. Gosh, this month is just moving by so fast. Because it's already the 13th. Yeah, so happy Saturday, Creepy 13. <laughs> well, you're on Tony's Witchy Awesome Crafts, and I'm Tony. Hi, hello. How you doing? <laughs> All right, um, it is uh, Creepy 13 collaboration hosted by Wandering Dreamer 555. I will have her um, channel linked in the description box. Please go check her out. When you watch her video and go to her description box, you can find the link to everyone else's videos that um, are playing along with her. Um, this collaboration is an open collaboration. Anyone can do it. Please join. It's a lot of fun. Um, it, especially if you like um, paper crafting for creepiness or just Halloween year-round, this is perfect for you. <laughs> All right, so for this month, let me show you what I've made. I made a card. I don't, let me stand back up. Let me see what you guys are seeing. Because there's a lot of layers to this. Okay. And what I mean by that is this top piece is like an acetate or something. And the card underneath, I stamped spiders. Isn't that cool? <laughs> I have fun with this one. Okay, so... The card base itself is, somebody sent me some card bases in a D-stash box. I think it was a D-stash box. It was these and the cards, they have this red edge to them. I think it's like on handmade paper or recycled paper or something. It's pretty cool. And even the envelopes that come with it, the back of it has a red edge too. It's almost a pink, pinky red to me, but I just took some extra red ink and just inked it up a little bit more, okay. which you can see here, it's much darker. And before I laid anything on top of the card, I stamped it with spiders and I kind of took some black ink and just inked the edges too. I don't know if you guys can see that. But. And then let's see, where's the stamp set that I used? I had it out. I did. Ah, there it is. It's from Michaels. Oops, sorry, I bumped. I bumped it, I bumped it. Sorry, sorry. Um, yeah, it's a stamp set from Michaels, you know. And I just used the spider. And then... And then the acetate piece is also from Michaels, from this paper pad. Um, my pen pal sent this to me. And it's just got a whole bunch of, like, creepy images in it like x-rays it's pretty neat well i haven't really used it for anything so i thought i need to like i need to use my stash right because <laughs> it's, it's it's building up okay and so this boo i used from that same stamp collection and i distressed the edges and then inked them like, I took my scissors and I rubbed it against the paper, making it look tathered. And then I inked it with red. And then this um, mesh behind it, you know, I had to use it. I just got it from Dollar Tree. And I'm in love with it. I used it up here, too, with some of the glitter mesh that I got from Joann's. Right? And then this guy, I received in a box of d stuff. 
whole bunch of Halloween. I take, I do, I take in uh, de stashes. I prefer Halloween, fall, um, Halloween, fall, and winter stuff like December or Christmas or holiday, like, because that's what I typically work with the most. So, yes, or just anything spooky. So, he was in there. Um, he was stamped in black. It wasn't a very dark black, so I inked it up more. And then I took just a little bit of like watercolor with like a brownish red and just yeah, kind of inked him up. And then I, um, to, to put this acetate on, I stapled it on. So to cover up the staple part on the front, I just put some of that Dollar Tree, um, uh, sequent trim that comes around Halloween time. Put that on there. And then I just put a spider web from that same stamp collection there on the inside with some spiders. And you can tell that I took some of the black ink and I just kind of like made it look like it's soot. Okay. And then for the card, um, or for the envelope, I sooted up the edges and then put one spider on the front because when I send it off to someone, you know, address, address, stamps, so I didn't want to like clutter it. And then I inked the back too with two spiders. So there we go. There's my creepiness on Creepy 13. Um, please tell me, what do you think? Is it creepy enough? <laughs> Alright, love you all. Have a good day. Bye.